fall is right around the corner, which means those hard squashes are starting to come in season. And I've got four of my favorites here, and I'm gonna show you how to prepare each of them. Butternut squash, acorn squash, kabucha, and spaghetti squash. No matter which hard squash you need to prepare, it all starts with a very sharp knife because these squashes have hard outer shells and are really thick and dense. So when preparing a butternut squash, there's a long part and then a wider part towards the bottom. The first thing I like to do is cut the squash right where the long part begins. From there, you can peel it using a peeler or use a knife. For the bottom part, use a peeler, cut it in half and carve out the inside of the seeds and discard those. Butternut squash is delicious, cut up and roasted and eaten just by itself, or it goes amazing in soups or stews. The next squash is an acorn squash, which is always popular during Thanksgiving and kind of those winter months. The best way to prepare this is using a sharp knife and cutting it right in half. You wanna scoop out the seeds and you literally just roast it right there with a little bit of butter, maybe brown sugar in the oven, skin side down. These aren't great squashes to try to dice up and peel up because they're oddly shaped and they've got grooves so it makes it really hard. So using them this way and simply scooping out and eating is the absolute best. You may not be familiar with this next one, the kabucha squash. It's also known as the Japanese pumpkin or the Andean pumpkin and the easiest way to prepare it is simply by tossing in the oven. You can wrap it in foil, totally up to you. Once it's done, it will literally break right in half. You can carve out the seeds and I like to just mash it up and eat it just as is. Last but not least is the spaghetti squash. What a phenomenal alternative to any gluten-filled pasta or if you're just trying to get more vegetables in your diet. It's absolutely delicious. Incredibly easy to prepare. Slice in half, scoop out the seeds, lay it cut side down on a sheet tray, add a little bit of water, put it in the oven for about 45 minutes. You sort of want to steam it in there. And then when it's done, you use a fork and you scrape it and boom, you've got beautiful spaghetti looking squash. These four squashes are so easy to prepare and so delicious, just simply eaten as they are roasted in the oven. Or again, I said you can add them into other ingredients, especially the butternut squash. I cannot wait to eat all of these. Be sure to get all these squashes from your favorite Heinen's grocery stores and visit Heinen's.com to see all of our great recipe videos and tutorials on how to prepare different foods. I've got a lot to eat. Catch up with you later.